2010 15-inch MacBook Pro DVD drive replacement, it is suggested that you remove the battery for this procedure. Begin by shutting down and flipping over the MacBook. We'll need to remove the three long Phillips head screws first. Now remove the seven short Phillips head screws. After removing these ten screws, the rear panel cover should be free. Go ahead and remove the rear panel cover. DVD drive removal. Begin by disconnecting the Wi-Fi cable from the logic board. Now disconnect the EyeSight camera cable. Disconnect the DVD drive. Now disconnect the cable from the Wi-Fi card and remove it. Remove the two Phillips head screws holding in the Wi-Fi bracket. Push the bracket over to the side. Remove the three Phillips head screws that are securing the DVD drive. Lift up and remove the DVD drive. Transfer the DVD drive cable and the rear screw bracket. DVD drive installation. Insert the new drive into the socket and drop it in. Install the three Phillips head screws to secure the drive in place. Connect the drive SATA cable to the logic board. Install the two Phillips head screws securing the Wi-Fi bracket. Connect the EyeSight cable to the logic board. You can now reinstall the Wi-Fi cable to the Wi-Fi card and then connect it to the logic board. Install the rear cover panel. Install the three long Phillips head screws first as shown. Now install the seven short Phillips head screws. 